Yeah, I think the most important thing to note is that we started this process by thinking a lot together and talking about a shared vision. And that was in season one of this uh, rollout, of course. Um, but that was really crucial in thinking together about the vision for kind of future world that we want to live in together and claiming the vital role of our human services, nonprofit member organizations in helping to realize that uh, vision together. That was really crucial and became the anchor for the new mission uh, statement, uh, which is tied back very explicitly to fulfilling the vision uh, that we share together. I think what was compelling to me about the process for how we went about building this new mission was that it was a collaborative process. Um, and there was space for every member of our strategic working group that included board members, staff members, folks on leadership, folks on our internal culture committee. Every single person got to kind of bring forward a piece of what they thought Max Mission was. What is our work? What are we really trying to do in our work? And we all got to voice it. And then we got to go through a really cool um, co-creation, co-selection process where we picked out, well, I like this, this really captures this. And we had a lot of debate um, about, well, what's the most important things that need to go into this mission? Um, and we just built it over time and going back and looking, okay, does this capture everything? What's missing? Oh, this doesn't feel quite right. I think this is really important to add back in. And it was this collaborative co-creation process um, that out of which evolved this really powerful and compelling mission. Working on this mission statement with the strategic planning committee, one of the pieces that I think made a big difference is that we had written the vision first, more or less completely. We already knew what kind of world we were envisioning uh, when we decided how we're gonna try to get there and how to articulate what our mission is. It was also an extremely collaborative process of figuring out this mission. There were basically like eight to 12 people all in a room together, writing two sentences together. There was not a subcommittee, there was not a writing group. We all worked on it. And that was MAC leadership, member leadership, MAC staff, um, all together trying to figure out what we're all working towards. I think the new mission really gets at the why um, we all deserve to live in a more equitable world. That's what all of our organizations are for. That's what we're all working for together. And I think stating that in our mission and having that already in our back pocket when we wrote the mission helps us be really clear that we're trying to get somewhere specific. Uh, Mac has always been hard to explain. Um, and so the process of getting to a mission statement for Mac uh, it, it was messy, it was arduous. Uh, it also ended up with some magic at the end. Um, really trying to, getting to see those ideas all come together on a, on a piece of paper. Anybody who's been through the process of writing a mission statement for a nonprofit will tell you it is messy. It can be hard, it can be frustrating. In a planning process, you're getting all this input from all corners around an organization and um, you know, community input, stakeholder, you know, peer organization input, employee input, and for MAC, member input. And some group of people around a table are trying to take these ideas and bring them together into something that reflects the organization now. And this work that MAC has been doing for 25 years, I think, you know, we're providing networking, we're providing peer learning opportunities, um, and we're, we built this like really unique set of tools and these administrative back office services that we share. But why do we do that? Well, we do that to make our organizations in the network uh, stronger so that they can um, build community well-being, right? To strengthen community well-being, to build a more equitable society.